Okay, so welcome back to yet another episode with me, Worst Game of Chilling, sitting here down in my basement dwelling, cozying, cozying it up with a sweater, uh, some some slippers, a good comfortable chair, nice lighting, and something to drink, <laughs> of course. We're back at it again. Last time, last episode. <clears throat> We were at the base where the first order, the first, uh, resided. We talked to Paxton and yeah, he got himself killed. <clears throat> he wanted to die honorably in the battlefield, but yeah, he got, he got that. Uh, he got an honorable death. So now we're going back, we're taking down. Ron Hope, right? Yeah, that's the one behind it all. So let's get into it. Please respond. Okay, it's yeah, nice that's to right. See you. Been busy risking your ass for total strangers, huh? Yeah. Uh, we were furloughed on New Atlantis for some R and R. Just got our orders that we're shipping out. No idea exactly where. They like treating us marines like mushrooms an awful lot. Kept in the dark and, you know, the rest. How about you? Well... If the prize is right, I'm willing to risk. I can't let the marines steal all the glory. You are one of the strangest creatures I've ever met. <laughs> Thank you. A veritable anomaly. Do I have to? <sighs> Fine. Private <clears throat> Sai says, hi. No more passing messages. Decorum, marines. <laughs> so, yeah. Command signed off on our unauthorized training mission. Sadly, lost some men, but training accidents happened to the best of us. Yeah. That was one hell of a training mission. <laughs> yeah. I stand by it. You'd make a hell of a marine. But uh, damn proud to know you too. Command's shipping us off to parts unknown. Would you accept a final parting gift? <laughs> of course. It's a nice thought, but the galaxy's a big place. A lot of yeah. good people owe you their lives. Maybe one day some of us can return the favor. Myung out. Berserker uh, calibrated what? Parting gift. Berserker calibrated tombstone. That's, that's more damage the less armor one has. So if I have less armor, this gun does more damage? Or or is it my enemies? No. <clears throat> okay. Looks looks terrible, but I mean yeah. Might be good. I don't know. Uh, yeah. <laughs> well, thank you. Wow, it's worth 12,500. Yo! That's a rare weapon. Okay, where are we headed? Uh, mission. Hope Town. We're supposed to go to Hope Town. Okay, yeah, 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 that's right. Okay, we're we're landing on Hope Town. I see. Uh, here, but is it that wise to to confront him on his own terms when he's strong in his factory in his city? I'm not sure this is such a good idea. So, 
To think yeah. one man made all of this. Yeah. Nathan was here until Ron Hope. Ron Hope. Did I say Ron Hope? Yeah, maybe I did. I don't know. Anyway, this seems really stupid. Oh, this! look at this ship. It's cool. Can I steal it? I would like a ship like this. Stroud Eklund. Look at the mist. This is so beautiful. Should I steal this? Inaccessible. I can't. Damn it. I really want this chip. Looks cool. Can I get one of those? Ah, let, let's not uh, do that now. Uh, my ship is good as well. I mean, it's not the most <laughs> beautiful ship, but gets the job done. However, I don't think this will be a good idea to confront him. Anything I can help you with? Uh, he, he's too powerful. I don't hear any complaints. Hello. Keep an eye on your valuables. If you can't protect your own. Yeah, I don't like this. This was literally nothing until Ron Hope came here. Oh, you, you seem to admire him. <coughs> this is not gonna be good. Trucks in space. <laughs> Their motto always cracks me up. Better prices for a hauler. <laughs> oh, he's over there. What? Can we get out? No. We'd be dust except for the factory. Oh, come on. I can't. Okay, we need to go down. Yeah, okay. Uh, let's get down there. I've got more shaving. Here we go. Factory floor. Here we come. Are we authorized to go anywhere we like? I don't know. No one is saying anything, so. Whoa! That's a new kind of ship they're building. <coughs> that's an engine? Whoa, that's a big engine. Big ass engine. Okay, he's over here somewhere. Oh, I thought he was on top floor. I, I see. Uh, how do I get there? That's very generous, Mr. Hope. It's well earned, Bert. Nothing ever good comes. We set some ambitious quotas. You met every one of them. Well, I won't pretend it was easy, but everyone pulled together and we got it done. I'll let you share the good news whenever and. However you like. Thanks. I appreciate that. Uh, Ron. R Ron. Hello. Hello. Something more you need, deputy? Good to see you again. Well, I've just received a report from the marshal about your progress. He said you had a promising lead on the mercenaries who stole my ship. I trust you're here with good news? <laughs> <laughs> nope. Uh, not good news for you. You can drop the act, Hope. Did you now? Well, don't keep me in suspense. Uh, okay, should I just go straight with him? Paxton Hall to... I'm afraid Paxton Hall has implicated you in a conspiracy against Freestar Collective. It's over, Hope. You know. <laughs> Is there something you want to tell me about hiring the first? No. And I don't care for the insinuation. Well, then you're not gonna like this. The disgraced war hero. 
who went to prison, and you actually believed him? Yeah. Uh. He knew we'd find him. I see. <laughs> yeah. I'm impressed, deputy. It's clear you have a <laughs> bright future ahead of you. What's going on? What is this about, Mr. Hope? Nothing that concerns you, Birgit. Birgit. In fact, why don't you make yourself scarce? Oh, now I he's... I think I'd like to hear what the tone. deputy has to say. It's a different tone now. <laughs> Birgit. <laughs> Uh, Birgit, tell me everything. I'm sure you had a good reason for doing this. Start talking, you traitorous bastard. Uh. Uh, the cards are on the table. So why not? The truth is, we've been falling behind the competition. <laughs> Significantly so. We needed solutions. A few years ago, I began to diversify. We started to research chemicals, fuel, those sort of things. We yeah. developed an experimental fertilizer. Oh. <laughs> and it failed utterly. It wiped out entire crops. I was prepared to write the whole thing off. When we made a discovery that changed everything, turns out our fertilizer was transforming the soil bolstering its mineral content tenfold mineral content okay I'm waiting farmers <coughs> but how could you transform the earth adding minerals minerals can't just grow it, it's formed over centuries. <coughs> uh, so you used unwitting farmers to transform the soil. Not all at once, of course. But we could never find anything that would grow in it. Yeah? Eventually, everything we tried to plant failed. Yeah, if there's minerals, too much minerals. Uh. We donated the fertilizer to select homesteads and let the farmers do the work. And when the time was right, we cleared the farm and brought in machinery to harvest the mineral-rich soil. The reduction in yeah. labor, materials, costs sent my profits soaring. You tricked them into poisoning their own land for your benefit. I have a business to run. <laughs> I can't afford to spend a credit more than I absolutely have to, Mr. Ko. Oh, yeah? To seize the farmland and keep the operation a secret. Doing what you thought was necessary to save your company. <laughs> you destroyed lives to turn a profit. How could you possibly justify this? Look around you. <clears throat> Everyone in this building, in this town. Yeah, 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 yeah sure. Yeah, on yeah, me. Yeah. I provide the jobs that put food on their tables, clothes on their backs, and roofs over their heads. I've heard it before. The fact is, the business hasn't been doing well lately. Without drastic action, cuts would become unavoidable. These people work hard for me, and they trust me to do the same in return. I cannot. I will not. Let them down. Oh yeah, that's the that's the reason, right? <laughs> Not your profit. I never intended for anyone to be hurt. I told Hull to buy the land, not take it by force. Unfortunately, farmers can be stubborn folk. Of course. And I couldn't risk any witnesses. I can't believe what I'm hearing. How could you do something so so awful to innocent people to families not another word out of you Birgit <laughs> I can take your job and more oh yeah we'll 
discuss this later. In any case, I suppose the gig is up. Yep. I give you my word that I'll call off the operation and return the land to its rightful owners. <laughs> the people you hired muscle kill, what about them? You're right, of course. Something must be done. I'll <coughs> set up a fund to handle funeral expenses and take care of any surviving family members. <laughs> we'll do this the right way. I give you my word. Yeah, 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 yeah. You're right. Yeah. Those families deserve to be compensated for the uh, inconvenience. Inconvenience? Mm, well, uh, perhaps a discount on their next purchase from Hope Tech. A coupon? I can't believe this guy. <laughs> With that resolved, let's talk about you. <clears throat> As a member of the Council of Governors, I'm authorized to award you a substantial substantial bonus and of course we'll both agree to forget about my little cost-cutting endeavor uh yeah i have to do my job twenty thousand credits How about I give you something instead? Funeral? <laughs> of course you do. But first, take a moment to consider the big picture. I'll do what's necessary to protect my company and my employees. If you tell anyone about this, you're risking their livelihoods. No, oh, they will be fine. Want to put they will be fine. These people out of work and make their families suffer. They can go on working under new government or governance. Uh, uh, don't try to put this on me, Hope. I'm willing to accept some collateral damage if it means making you pale. But on a much larger scale, yes. I don't want anyone to suffer, I want justice. Justice can be complicated, Deputy. Sometimes no. the cost of exacting justice is greater than the cost of doing nothing. What do you want? I'll make myself very plain. I won't let you jeopardize my reputation, this company, or the people who work for me if that Are you means you suffer an unfortunate incident at the hands of my security yeah, personnel that's right. he's so threatening me be it i'm important oh. you're nothing you're not are you actually threatening to attack a free star ranger are you careful i think he means business uh <clears throat> bribes and threats aren't going to work on me for your employees' sake, I'll keep your secret, but your scheme ends. Oh, we need to attack. Okay. Damn Such it. a shame to see a promising career cut so tragically short. Oh! Fighting! Who's fighting? Oh, who's shooting? Who's up there? Your time's coming up. Why are you running away? Is that Bert? No, it's not Birgit. There we go. Okay. 
Eliminate his security team. Done. Oh, get out of my way. Sam. Sam the man. Okay. <coughs> we'll loot these guys. He had a rattler. Whoa, look at the texture. It's so awful. <laughs> Uh, yeah, I had to shoot him. What are we doing now? Talk to Birgit. Talk to Birgit. McDougal. <laughs> okay. She ran away and hid. Hello, Birgit. Hello. He, he tried to have you killed. Yep. I don't understand. Mr. Hope always seemed like such a good person. But everything he said about the farmers and hiring those mercenaries, it was so awful. Yep. Nobody else. No, you're wrong. That's not all he was. Yes. He yes, he was. He always for us, for his employees. So they would help him. That's why. <clears throat> Monster. I... We never <laughs> saw that side of him. And now he's... You. You killed him. I had to. Uh, Nobody should ever want that. Especially when it means killing someone who meant so much to so many people. <sighs> what happens to us now? Yeah. Second in command. It's probably the end for Hope Tech. That's... That would be... Elana. Elana Nwankwo. What? She seems pretty capable. Maybe... Maybe we'll be okay after all. Of course. I guess we'll have to figure things out. Find a path forward. There's a lot of smart, hard-working people here. You'll figure it out. Yeah. However, I don't think they will be happy with me killing one of the members on the council. So, yeah, we have to have to smooth things over here. Are we going back? You have any special high technology weapons I can get my hands on? High technology weapons. No, something like that. Okay. <clears throat> Let's get out of here. Oh, what? Talk to Marshall. We could fast travel, right? Cheyenne. Let's go there. <clears throat> okay. Welcome to the Free Star Collective. Please maintain your current course while we scan your ship. Maintain my current course. All right, you're good. Welcome to Aquila City. Land. Oh, I, I don't like this conversation. <clears throat> We're gonna have to explain ourselves. The aluminium family of... Okay. Maybe I should explore outside of this town? Maybe there are some 
scary monsters to find. Ship services. Word to the wise. Get in there. See what they'll say if they're angry with me or Yeah, I'd like to maybe meet one of these guys. See if they're so tough. They look really tough. What? Welcome to the rock. Oh, thank you. Welcome to the rock, I guess. No! I ran past it? Oh, they're down here. Hello. Good to see you back safe, deputy. What's the word on the mech factory? Were well, the mercenaries hiding out there? Yeah. But I took care of them. Yeah. But it's more like a mass grave. <laughs> Your guess was right on the money. It was their base. I take it that they weren't too much trouble for you, given that you're standing here. Did you find out why the first was taking over farms? Uh, Ron Hope hired the first to grab farmland. It was a part of Mr. Hope's plan to save his company. What? Ron Hope? That's one hell of an accusation, Deputy. Are you really <coughs> that surprised? Hope's always had a reputation as a man who'd do anything to succeed. He's on the damn council, Emma. Not anymore. So he can make laws favorable to his business interests. Sure, he's known to look after his people, but do you really think he gives a damn about some farmers on Montara Luna? Did Hope explain his motives at all? He supplied the farms with an experimental fertilizer. It boosted the soil's mineral content but killed the crops. Something about fertilizers. <sighs> that has a familiar ring to it. I recall hearing about some Hope Tech initiative to help farmers. At the time, I just figured it was a PR stunt. Seems a little more sinister now. Yep. Please, tell me you've got some evidence to back up these extraordinary claims. <laughs> uh, these are Hope's instructions to Paxton Hall. <laughs> All right, let's see what you've got. Hmm. Interesting. Yeah, this is pretty damning. Especially this last bit about destroying the slate. <laughs> and you confronted Hope about this? Yeah. I'd hope he would turn himself in, but he wouldn't go down without a fight. He tried to have me killed. It was his last mistake. Damn. This is going to send shockwaves throughout the Free Star Collective. Yeah. If people can't trust their leaders. Anarchy could follow. Have a little faith, Daniel. We're not the United Colonies. One bad apple won't spoil the whole damn barrel. Easy for you to say. You ain't the marshal. Not yet, but you ain't gonna live forever, old man. <laughs> While we've got you here, there's one last piece of business to take care of. Emma, would you please? With pleasure, Marshal. When you first joined us, I told you that you'd undergo an evaluation process. There's one thing left to do. A simple question. Do you oh. feel ready to wear the badge of a full-fledged Freestar Ranger? Uh, yeah. Good. Duty and honor are the backbone of the Freestar Rangers. Marshal, I approve the deputy for advancement to the rank of Ranger. Thank you, Ranger Wilcox. In your time serving as a deputy, you've shown exceptional courage, fearless tenacity, and a high regard for the safety of our citizens. By the authority granted to me by the Council of Governors, 
I hereby promote you to the rank of Ranger. Here's your badge. Wear it with pride. But don't forget the solemn responsibility it represents. Congratulations. Okay. You truly deserve it. It's about downtown. <laughs> Thank you for having faith in me. I know you will, Ranger. Let's hear it for our new Ranger. Huzzah! Huzzah! Wait a go! Oh, thank you, thank you very much. Star Eagle Award. Uh, the, uh, what? As a full fledged three star ranger, you have been granted your very own Star Eagle. Oh, Starship. No registration fee. Okay. Yo. Congratulations. The promotion's well earned. Thank you very much. Okay, so I, I've got a new ship now. A lot of famous people visit Aquila. Popping back a beer, you never know who you'll meet. Yeah, okay. So Sam, are you coming with me or... Hey, Emma. Ju just gonna stand there? So, let's go and have a look at this ship. Maybe it's beautiful, maybe it's not. Uh, we'll continue with the. We'll co continue with the main empty nest. Galbank Vault. Oh, that's here, right? Yeah, that's over there. That's right. Oh, that's. That's why we started this quest line, because we were supposed to go to the bank, but there was a hostage situation over there, so we got interrupted, and yeah, I, w I wanted to be this free star ranger. So, where is my ship? Can I talk to anyone? Um. Hello? Can I talk to you? Services check. Sorry. Spaceport's always a zoo. No. <clears throat> How do I change? Row one oak. Is it inside here? Citizen, some technician, maybe. Hello. Hey, what can I do for you? Got anything you need to offload? Trade authority is always buying. Kiosk right here for you. Okay, no problem. Modify my ships. Okay, so we got uh, Roanoke. We got the Frontier. That's a cool ship. It's a bit dirty now. Huh. Razor Leaf. The Mantis quest line. We got Ecliptic Combat. I think I stole this. Yeah, I think I stole this ship. And Star Eagle. Uh, class A jump 16 it's got a big ass shield cargo capacity 2000 am I am I reading that right what no this small ship would Cargo capacity of 2200. What? That doesn't seem. 450. 800. Whoa, should I go with this one then? But it's brown. Hmm. Ok, 
can we upgrade? Uh, suppressor. Oh, I need to be... Starship design rank 4, okay. So I can't do anything? Yeah, okay, I, I'm not gonna change anything now. Sure, how about it? Just gonna see to it that that's my main ship. Uh, make home ship. H. Okay, there we go. It's waiting there for me, yes. That's beautiful. Got my own starship. Got a freighter coming soon. No time to talk. And we're going to the bank. Keep it moving. Maybe I should save. Yeah, let's save. Uh, rock. I kind of miss Andreja. Maybe I should go fetch her. Sam is okay, but I mean, Andreja is cool. Uh, hello. Can we go downstairs? You can, by preserving the heritage of Aquila City, we provide a vital service to those more esteemed families who've made their home here for generations. Okay. Well, not as much as we used to. Ever since Marshal Blake took charge of the Rangers, well, <laughs> things have been a lot quieter. There was a time those lock gang boys would be in here so often, we used to joke they ought to just open accounts. Gotta hand it to Marshal Blake, though. He's really got them on the run. But one thing I can say is I've never been a hostage before, and well, I think I've had my fill of that for a while. Oh, yeah, okay. He was still in there. a word heirlooms. Some of the old families, those descended from the city founders, store objects of value here. Yes, we've got items in our vault that have been passed down from generation to generation. I like to think that the entire heritage of Aquila City is stored right here for safekeeping. And me? Well, I'm the protector of that heritage. <laughs> <laughs> well, thank you for your business. Okay, uh, I didn't have to ask him, maybe. What, why would you have a Grendel just lying here? Um, for protection or what? <gasps> Money? Oh, uh, he's gonna, he's gonna see that. Okay. Let's see if there is a magazine. I'm always on the hunt for a magazine. Um... Uh, one of those cons or upgrade magazines. Oh, this is okay. Oh, I can't just steal that. Something upstairs. No magazine here. That would be stealing. Ventilation? What? Oh, I've been in the vent ventilation system, right? Because we had to free those... No, I did it uh, with persuasion. That's how it went down. Okay. Uh, this is to the outside, okay. No magazine. I can't see any magazines here. Yeah, okay. Going down. Into the vault. All right. The family has a few different deposit boxes secured in here, so let's look around. Here's a copy of the key. Red wine. 
Okay, now remember, Solomon was from an earlier generation, so it's not going to be on a slate. Big bundles of paper is what we're after. What are you talking about? Why, why are you standing out there? Okay, let's see. Unlock Co Galbank key card. Note for Sam. All right, let's see. Search for the maps. Okay. Oh, no. Jacob. Of course that old mule saw this coming. Okay. I'm walking into drama. This is the part where I walk into drama. Who's Jacob? Why did he take the maps? He's just a bitter old man. Interfering in what's none of his business. Okay. There we do. I was hoping to avoid the estate when we landed. Cora's gonna be so mad. Why? Uh, n no sense delaying it. We need those maps. Because I told her we wouldn't have time to check in with her. <laughs> Look, I was trying not to do this, okay? Yeah. Yeah, you're right. Let's do this. Rip the band-aid. Rip the band-aid. Uh, okay. Are you coming? Okay. Bye. I, I didn't even remember we were looking for maps, actually, so this is fresh for me. <coughs> we're apparently looking for maps, and he took him. I Jacob say, took my him. My family was on the first ship. Proper founders. My family came in, what, 10, 15? You know I went to chef school? <laughs> you know I went to chef school? Okay. Seriously? What? What? Ser Seriously, what? Am I full fledged? Can, can I have the first? Ah, okay. Ranger Jewel Wear. What? Should I go with this one? Because this is the deputy. I'll take this one off. Let's go with this. Yeah, I'm a full-fledged ranger now, so. So, this is... Whoa, look at her eyes. She looked crazy. Okay, let's get in here. <sighs> Jacob, give me the maps. Well, well. He's busy. Sam Cole finally decides to darken our doorstep again. You know why I'm here. Oh? And what's that? You come to your senses? Realize where you ought to be for once? <laughs> I ain't asking again. You ain't asked once. Let's hear it. I want you to say the words about what's more important to you than family. Okay, this was a mistake. The only mistake I'm seeing here is you. Bringing your constellation lackey here instead of my granddaughter. Come to help Sam loot his ancestry? You're not getting those maps. Full stop. Your companion can speak on your behalf. What they will say is written next to their name. Uh, okay, your companion can speak on your behalf. What they will say is written... Okay, so... Whoa, don't drag me into this. I've got as much right to those maps as 
anyone. Okay. Nothing's more important than family. Nothing. <laughs> Sam had stuck around, he'd know that. You wouldn't be here. All right, that's enough. Come on, let's you and I talk. In private. <laughs> Welcome home, Sam. Make your visit short, okay? It's what you do. Any day you make it through is a victory in my book. What what do we need to talk about? Give me a sec. <sighs> All right, let's talk options. I could speak to Jacob. He might see reason. The maps have to be somewhere. You distract him. I can look around. You need a minute? No, I don't. It's just... It's been a while, but this is how it goes. Every time. Okay. No, no, no. <laughs> I mean, this is no place for her, okay? The less time she spends with Jacob, the better. Okay. Uh... You didn't mind her coming along until this came up. She Dance. can help? Fine, fine, fine. We'll, we'll go <clears throat> get her. I just, if there's any other options, I'd appreciate doing those first. Yeah, but... Yeah, you're gonna steal them? Ask Cora for help. Oh, you've been... East eavesdropping the whole time. Damn. Mm, okay, let's go talk to Cora. I mean, she she would want to meet her granddad, right? That could be good, fun. She's in the chip. You're out there a lot, right? Yeah, I'm out there a lot. It's this. Okay. Safe travels, gate two. Hey. Hey there. Need to make a quick getaway, or is this a we're coming back for the better weapons kind of thing? Better... Oh. <sighs> better weapons. Uh, we need your help at the co estate. Grandpa Jacob? Are we going to see him? Dad said no last time. And I'd still be saying no if I had any choice in the matter. And by the way, I thought I told you not to pry. Can we just do this? So is the answer yes? That's usually Dad's way of saying yes. It is? Well, it's an affected situation, but... Really? We need your help. Over my strong objections. <laughs> Works for me. Let's go. Come on. Come on, Sam. It's not that bad. They have to meet sometime. Right? It's her granddad. Who's fastest? Who's the fastest? Hi, I'm winning. I'm winning. Keep your nose clean. Last thing I want is to charge you for a D, an A, a B, a B, an E, or a B. <clears throat> ah, you're too slow. There. People joke, say those Varun zealots worship a snake. But let me tell you, it ain't a snake. It's some kind of celestial being. They call what? it the Great Serpent. Is it real? <laughs> Hell if I know. 
but they think it is, and that makes them dangerous. Okay. <laughs> Are you talking to me or just talking to yourself? So I'm not getting along good with Sam. <laughs> There's my girl. Look how big you've grown. You should see my right hook now. I bet I could knock you flat on your butt, old man. Now that's the spirit. If only your ancestor Solomon could be here to see how bright the co-future looked. Can we move this along? Uh, don't listen to him, my darling. You uh, stay what? here with me during your visit. Coa State's a much better place than some musty old starship. But it's my starship. It's, it's really great. No. She was just popping in to say hi. That's it. You want those maps, Sam? <laughs> I don't think I don't see what you're up to. She'll be safe here while you're doing whatever it is you're gonna do. Fine. Hand them over. You have what you wanted. Now off Oh! We got the maps? Just like that? Uh, are you binding garlic or what's this? Do you have a magazine? What's this? Antique toy motorcycle. A band? The Shin Shinjiro 5? Violet? Is this her room or huh let's see bathroom okay nothing special book okay we're supposed to talk to Sam right oh this is maybe his old room the refurbishing and a plushie Star pal. Oh, it's a star pal. Oh, wait a minute. Where do I go now? I went outside. Okay. It wasn't my intention to go outside. But, okay. Oh, oh. <laughs> what? Why are you walking around in your underwear? Guarding? Okay, yeah. Let's talk. Let's talk. All right. Let's see if we can find the empty nest. All right, let me think. The way I heard it, the readings he was getting were normal at first, then they bottomed out. And no creature, alien or otherwise, would dare step inside. There. Found it. What? Oh, boy. <sighs> That's a problem. What? Don't say things like that. My anxiety is bad enough. <laughs> Just tell me what's wrong. First, it's in the middle of the frontier, which we already expected. No problems there, but the usual tussling with alien wildlife. Yeah. But the empty nest is a cave right in the middle of Shagang territory. Mm. Same outlaws who held up Galbank. Mm. Uh, criminals with our artifact, they'd better not break it or sell it. Damn, I was hoping we were done with them. Bringing outlaws to justice sounds like fine work. How are they surviving outside the Criminal walls? groups in Aquila always find a way. But they usually have to keep on the move to avoid the Ashta. Well, oh. It could just be a coincidence that the cave we want happens to be where the Shaw Gang runs around. But something doesn't feel right. Okay. Well, just remember, it's about the artifact, not them. Hurting bad guys puts a smile on your face, that's a bonus. <laughs> Let's get to that cave. Okay. Travel to the empty nest. I'm getting a feeling it's not empty, so... Oh, we're back inside. That's right. Okay. Uh, I was hoping for a magazine of some Don't sort. Don't worry about me. Hanging out at the estate is great. Yeah, Sam. Why didn't you want your daughter... To stay here. This is really good. They can spend time together. They have tabletop games. The 
they have fruits, some plants, spaceship, toy spaceship, uh, but no magazine, plushie. Here we go. Permanently increase weapon damage at, at night. Why? Oh, and that's Solomon Co. Oh. <laughs> okay. But increase damage at night? Why? Aquila City. Okay. We're going. I found a magazine at least, so it's always something. We're off to. Hey, no funny stuff with that booze pack. Got enough like traffic as it is. What? Who do you take me for? Okay. Are we just gonna run there? How do we get there? We're just running out outside. Gee, surface map. Oh, it's not that far. Okay, I see. Yep, it's not that far. Huh? Empty nest. Is there any way back in later? Well, let's do it. You're coming? Yep. Big ass rope. It's not cleared for human personnel. Uh, it's not. Well, we have to run here, so okay. So I think I'll do this uh, uh, spelunking, cave diving in the next episode. Someone leaving. Whoa, that was close. Okay. Some plants. No. Aluminium. This is a plant. What's the readout? Just a plant. Nothing. Oh, look at that. Is that dangerous? Oh. oh! Oh! Yeah, that's one of those. Oh! Another freaky... Let's take care of these guys. Let's see if we can shoot him. Company, oh. I think. Ashta. Oh, oh. I didn't see that one. Okay. Yeah, it's these guys. They are freaky. Oh boy. Luckily, where did that other gigantic monster go? They're over there. Okay, they can stay there. We'll scan things. Oh boy. Don't want to meet more of those Ashtas.
Oh, here's a. Oh, there's one. Okay, it's low level. Save prayers, pal. There are more. No. Okay. What's that? Never mind. Oh, I see more. Oh, that's a grasshopper. <laughs> Gonna die. Big one. Oh. <sighs> Throwing things. Oh. Damn. Anal, Jessic. I don't think I want to touch that. Did we scan this one. Oh. Okay. Everything wants to kill you here. Oh. Sam. Why didn't you do anything? Okay, run. Run for it. Let's scan this. What's this? Water? Oh, Ashta, run. Come on, get up. Oh, we're there. Oh, this is not abandoned. Yeah, it's Smugglers not. Smugglers would be wise not to tangle with us. <laughs> okay, yeah, I'm gonna save it there. Okay, now I know what we're doing. Oh! Okay, I'm gonna pause it there. Yeah, I'll see you back in the next episode and we'll take these guys out. See you back in the next one. Take care. Bye!